Hey okay, everybody, my name is Law and welcome to the channel. So we're back into the good place. We're on episode three. Uh, so let's jump in. This is called Tahini Al Jamal. So let's uh, let's see what's happening in the good place today. Let's see what trouble Eleanor can get into. So Aristotle was Plato's student, and Aristotle believes that your character is voluntary because it's just the result of your actions, which are under your control. Hello. To honey. Hi. What brings you here? You know, I was just uh, in the neighborhood <laughs> to get to Eleanor because you know we're all in the same afterlife, so you know I'm always in the neighborhood. <laughs> Do you get it? I do, and it's delightful. And oh, Tahani. Welcome to the neighborhood. Even though we all arrived here at the same time, here's some dirt I put in a bowl because I'm amazing. I thought it was kind of a nice gesture. Oh, cheaty. It's a total con. I see through her little act. Her act of being a nice person who brings you gifts? Bingo. Oh, <laughs> maybe you should return the favor. Bring her something. Oh, so now I'm supposed to be nice and make friends and treat her with mutual respect? Yeah. That's exactly what she wants me to do, Chidi. Wake up! <laughs> I thought that was the that, whole that's point. That's what everyone wants everyone to do. Hello, Eleanor. Johnny, darling, look, it's Eleanor from next door. Fresh pears. It's a plant, just like your gift, but you can actually eat them. So maybe it's a better gift. Who's to say? That's so kind. However, in um, Chinese culture, pears are actually a symbol of bad luck, and, and I wouldn't want to offend Gianni, so I'm afraid I'm going to have to throw these in the garbage, but do come and sit down. <laughs> <laughs> but we, have, we must keep our heads up. In fact, tomorrow I'm actually going door to door to make sure that every single person in this entire neighborhood is keeping calm and carrying on. Because I think that helping others will make me feel like I truly belong here, you know? Here's a brainstorm. Why don't I go with you? I mean, I would love to do my part to help the neighborhood, not to mention get a little bonding time with you, lady. Oh, hurrah! <laughs> Such fun. I'm telling you, Tahani's out to get me. What are you talking about? This note was slipped under my door yesterday. It has to be Tahani. She just said to me, I want to feel like I truly belong here. Well, where have I seen the word belong recently? Oh, yeah, kapla. Okay, I... The point is, she straight up sucks, bro. Whoa. Typical Tahani. Brings us a faulty plant so she can brag about being no, a better No, it's her gun. negative energy. No, I think this is another way in which your negative actions affect this world. This plant represents your relationship to Tahani. So when you're mean to her, it starts to wilt. Cool. So tell me about yourself. I mean, I want to hear it all, girlfriend. The good, the bad, the really bad, the embarrassing, the humiliating. Just let's bond. OK, well, I, I was born in Pakistan, raised in London, schooled in Paris. But I think the primary reason that I'm in the good place is that I raise quite a lot of money for non-profit groups. Oh. Oh, this is silly. So Tahani means congratulations in Arabic, and Al Jamil means beautiful. So my full name altogether means... Congratulations, beautiful. Thanks, Eleanor. Big flirt. <laughs> this is the perfect hobby for you, Chidi. Cartography. Your neighborhood stretches wow, way that. beyond what you've already seen, and you can map it, revealing all of the mysteries like an explorer. I see how that might be fun. Uh, but uh, exploring makes me nervous. I have what doctors call directional insanity. I once got lost on an escalator. Let's forget about exploring. Plenty more ideas for hobbies. Let's walk back to town, shall we? Okay. <sighs> Wrong way. Yep. <laughs> oh, can you, darling? Would you like some tea? That nod meant no, apparently. Well, it was nice to get out and meet all of our wonderful neighbors. They all truly belong here. Mm. Yes, they do, cutie pants. Whoop. Well, I should really be going. I have to begin my 12-step Korean skincare regimen, but uh, I'll see you. Oh, no, no, no. Please, stay and enjoy the evening tea. I'll see you soon. Mm. Mm. Art welding. You can learn sculpture. You can make furniture. You can get your hands a little greasy, you know, and you make things. This equipment <laughs> is very scary. 
Don't be a baby. It can't hurt you. Watch. I'll blow torch your face off. I'm Janet. Whatever. <laughs> this whole thing is stupid. Oh, brother. I told her to be less flirty, and now she's cruel and distant, apparently. Petey, here's the thing. See, I, I read your whole book, all 3,600 pages of it. It's, um, how shall I put this? It's a mess, dude. Hey! She's right. You see, Chidi, I can read the entirety of the world's literature in about an hour. This took me two weeks to get through. I mean, it's so <laughs> convoluted. I just kept reading the same paragraph over and over again, trying to figure out what the heck <clears throat> you were saying. Oh, no. I mean, on, on, on page 1,000, you start section two with the sentence, of course, the exact opposite might be true. You're a brilliant guy, Chidi, but you just kept revising and rewriting and adding words to your title. I think you just twisted yourself up into a knot. I have a very bad stomachache. What's wrong? Am I a good teacher? Am I, am I clear? Do I make sense? Yeah, you're a great teacher. I'm super ethical now. What is she hiding under her shirt? <laughs> no, don't worry about it. I stole Tahani's diary so I could see if her handwriting matches the note and also read about all the mean and terrible things she's definitely done so I can prove she's actually evil. Huh. That's so good. What do you think that means? <laughs> she wrote that note. No, she didn't. You did. I, I was hoping you would come to this conclusion on your own, but obviously, no one here would ever threaten you. That note is the good place manifesting your own guilt, like with the plant, or when you literally made giant shrimp fly through the air. I wrote myself the note. No, you, you don't belong here. And in this place, everyone is better than you. It has been proven by an infallible formula. Tahani might be a little British and condescending at times, but she devoted her entire life to helping other people. She's a good person. Accept that. Good people make me insecure. When I'm around someone who I think is better than me, I try and drag them down to my level. That's why perfect Tahani is like my kryptonite. Well, even admitting that is an important step. I loved writing this book, and I want to try again. So. Will you be my advisor? Chidi, all I want is for you to be happy. So if spending eternity getting blunt feedback on your circular rambling ideas will make you happy, then of course I will be your advisor. Let's throw <laughs> that monstrosity in the trash and start over. Aren't there maybe some parts worth salvaging? Honestly, man, I don't even know. I mean, that thing is unreadable. I literally learned what headaches were because that thing gave me a headache. Okay. <laughs> there you go. New beginnings. Well done. Oh, oh hello, Eleanor. <laughs> Sorry, I was just cleaning up. <laughs> Are you okay? Do you want to talk about it? Desperately. It's Gianu. I just can't seem to connect with him. I know that he took a vow of silence, but he won't even talk to me, his soulmate. Well... I may not know exactly what you're feeling, but I do understand. And you deserve to be happy because you are an impressive, thoughtful, and special person. You two belong here, and you belong together. And you have all of eternity, so there's plenty of time for things to change. Oh, thank you. I really needed to hear that. Come here. Ugh, of course your hugs are amazing. Ledge. No stairs. Why are there Ooh. no stairs? Everyone here was really into hugging. Looks like someone learned something. Oh, wow. Well, it's because someone else is a really good teacher. Um, look, Michael asked me if I would serve as his assistant, but I'd quite like to focus on my relationship with Jianyu. So, I recommended you for the job. <laughs> Eleanor, you and I could work side by side to figure out what's going wrong with this neighborhood. 
Will you help? Oh no. How could I say no? <laughs> <sighs> what now? Oh, maybe it is somebody. Relax, Eleanor. <laughs> you sent this to yourself. This is your own guilt manifesting itself. I've been waiting for you. She on you? Don't belong here. Admit it. Okay, you're right. I don't belong here. Michael made a mistake. But I'm trying, dude. I'm really trying to be a good person. And I think I'm changing for the better. So just please... Please don't wrap me out. Don't worry. I won't. Because I'm not supposed to be here either. I don't know how I got here. I have no idea what's going on, and I am freaking out, homie. You gotta help me. I'm scared. Oh. What? From your love. <laughs> he's, not, he's not a Buddhist monk either. Okay. Okay. That is, that is thrown a... Um, interesting interesting wrench into the cogs um okay okay that's getting very interesting so she's changing slightly known learning now we have to figure out what is going on what is going on with um the buddhist monk so that's going to be the next episode i'm sure we'll learn about that in the next few so let me know if you enjoyed that episode you can leave me a note here hopefully you enjoyed that uh remember if you want to see unedited full episodes go and check out the patron it is in the link in the description thank you guys stay safe and i'll definitely see you in the next reaction video did you enjoy that video why not watch another one